Hey guys, it's Sharon here and welcome back. I know it's been a while since I uploaded anything and I do apologize for that. It's been a little nuts. My life has just been really crazy. So I do apologize that this channel has been a little uh, sparse lately, but we're going to try to cure that because I have a lot of exciting things coming up that I want to show you guys. And first of all, please pardon the mess back here. I have my crochet mess back here. I have, oh my gosh, um, <laughs> I was digging out some of my yarn stuff the other day and I'm telling you what, I have a mess. Um, I have a couple of projects working on and for, uh, you know, I just, I kind of stick it there because sometimes I'll sit in this chair and crochet and it just kind of, sometimes it just lands up over there. So I do apologize for the chaotic background. Um, but you know, anyway, um, I'm going to go ahead and introduce, um, what's going to be happening today and I have a haul video for you today from the Goulet Pen Company. I ordered a pen and some ink and we're going to go ahead and unbox it. I'm going to show you guys just um, what you get when you shop with this company. It's an amazing family-owned company and I've shopped with them before and the experience is just wonderful. The people over there are just so 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 nice and now what the Goulet Pen Company is uh, is they specialize in uh, fountain pens and um, and ink for fountain pens and stuff and um, so yeah if you're into fountain pens it's a really really nice place to shop there's a whole gamut of different pens that you can get you know anything from the um, very very affordable to, all the way on up to like hundreds of dollars for um, a very very expensive pen <laughs> so um, you know if you're just starting out in fountain pens it's a great place to go to look for something if you're into fountain pens and are looking for something specific, uh, something that's going to run you a little bit more money, that's also a nice place to go to get that. And uh, also they have, um, gosh, what, what did he say that they had? Uh, I think he's got over 650 uh, different kinds of ink in stock. So, you know, if you're looking for ink for your fountain pens, that's a good place to stop and get it. Uh, they've also got different um, notebooks and papers and, and things like that too, but um, anything fountain pens, anything fountain pen ink, um, great place to shop, great people to deal with. Um, they're just, you know, I can't really say enough about them. I mean, their customer service is awesome. Um, you know, they're, they've always just been very helpful to me and they're just super, super nice. And, you know, they care about their business and you, you can tell just by the way they run it. You can tell by the way they pack things, um, which I'm going to get into in just a minute. You're going to kind of laugh a little bit, but I mean, they care about the customers. They care about their, uh, um, Brian Goulet calls them his team rather than employees. So, I mean, it's, it's just a, you know, I just, I can't say enough about them. Um, if you're, uh, you know, he does all kinds of uh, Q&A sessions on his YouTube channel. He does some blog posts and things like that to kind of, um, he's got a Fountain Pen 101 series that you can watch if you're just getting into fountain pens and stuff. So he's very helpful. He's very informative. Um, you know, if you're just uh, getting into it, as I said, or if you're experienced, um, just, you know, it's just a great one-stop shop place to, to get your things from. So anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the package. Okay, guys, so here we are back again, and, uh, you know, when I get a better tripod set up, I can do this at a, at a different angle, but for now, I'm just going to have to do it this way. So anyway, here is what the box looks like. Now, I'm not going to turn it over on the other side because it's got my address on it, and I don't want to show that, but it's a pretty big box, as you can see. So it comes wrapped in bubble wrap. I'll just kind of show you the inside. I opened up this part of it because it's really hard to open. Um, it's really sticky, so it, it gets a little nuts, but it comes with some bubble wrap. <laughs> it comes with a lot of bubble wrap, so more bubble wrap. And then as I reach inside, it's got, oh my goodness, before I show you that, this is the big package that I got. What they include is they include some other little goodies in here for you. Um, I have, if I can reach in the bottom of the box here, I'm going to set this aside. So what they have in here is they, super cute, they give you a little um, lollipop uh, kind of candy thing. I usually give those to my husband and my daughter. We also have a little um, card. It says, uh, I packed your order with a slightly ridiculous amount of care to make sure that your writing, uh, that your writing pr products you love will arrive safely today. I'd love to hear what you think about how I've packed it, um, or how, how I've done it. And then they got the website there. So 
you get a, a Goulet, um, you get a Goulet Pens bookmark. So that's what it looks like on this side. And keep in mind, my camera is a little backwards, you know, because I'm, I'm at this angle instead of actually, um, doing it on a tripod. Uh, hopefully I'll get a better tripod set up and then, um, it'll, it won't be so awkward. All right. So before I show you the package, I'll show you the, um, what they usually do is when they pack your order, they actually give you a little personal note. It says, Sharon, I hope you love your new ink. So now that we've got that out of the way, this is what the package looks like. So I have quite a few things in here. And it, again, comes wrapped in bubble wrap. We're going to take that off, which is pretty easy to do. But the thing that you're going to laugh at is what they do. Once you get, once you get the bubble wrap all off, they pack the stuff in blue saran wrap, as you can see. See, this is blue saran wrap right here. And sometimes it is, it is a pain to get off, but we're going to do the best we can. Okay, there's my pen. I'll show you my pen first. I have a Monteverdi uh, Prima in purple swirl. So this is the Monteverdi box that, that you're going to get with it. And I got this in a fine nib. Um, there's what the inside packaging looks like. There's the Monteverdi box, as, as you can see. Ooh, hi behind the box, yay. <laughs> so we're going to open it up, and then here is the pen that rests inside. It's got like the little, it's got like the little, um, holder right there to keep it in place, a little strap. And if you take out the papers, like there's a little secret compartment underneath here, you take that out. And then um, it comes with um, it comes with some ink cartridges in this little box, but I prefer to use a converter so that I can use bottled ink. And then here is a little card that, that they send you with that. So this is all your, your paperwork and your ink cartridges. But let's look at the pen itself. The pen itself is quite nice. I had one of these uh, for less than 24 hours before my husband just, uh, kind of a funny story was, um, my husband got one of these for me and um, he ended up, um, it ended up catching his eye so I could tell that he wanted it like really bad. So um, he kept like giving me this eye like every time I had it out. So I said here, so I gave him the one that I had and then I, and then I got myself this um this one here. So now we're twins. <laughs> but this is what this is what it looks like. It's got some really nice purple swirls in it. I hope you can I hope you can see that. I'm trying to trying to get it up on the camera here. There's the uh gosh. There's the clip right there. And then um here is the nib. Try to get it so that we can see it. There's a Bonaparte, and then here is um, that right there. I believe it's steel plated, so or st st like stainless steel, so it's not going to be your your gold nib or anything like that. Um, this pen cost, um, I think it was like a fifty five dollar pen, so it's a nice. Um, like if you're not really, um, into fountain pens all that much, but you're kind of wanting to get started, and and you kind of experimented with like the more, um, sort of bottom end, like, you know, your $15 ones, maybe there, there's a couple there, like a platinum preppy that's like four bucks or something like that. Um, there's a pilot metropolitan that's about 15. There's a Lamy Safari that's like, um, I think I want to say like 35. Um, you know, so I mean, this is a little bit higher in price. So if you're kind of getting to where you're liking fountain pens and you want to kind of explore something a little bit more, um, sort of, sort of getting up into the mid-range kind of stuff. This is sort of your bottom mid-range, I guess. That's, that's what I would call it. So that is my, um, Monteverdi, uh, Prima in purple swirl. And then I will show you the ink that I got. We're going to put this aside. And again, this blue saran wrap. <laughs> Sometimes it's really, really hard to get off, but we're going to do our best. And I brought my scissors in here, which I think I'm going to break out. That way I can just cut it, and then I won't have to make a career out of this video. So as you can see, 
like I said, oh, excuse me. Like I said, they, ooh, they, um, they care very much about how your package comes. You know, they care about their customers. Uh, Goulet Pen Company, that is. They care about their customers. They, they just care about the people that they deal with. You know, their distributors. Uh, you know. Okay, there's two of them. I forgot how many I bought. I think I bought, uh, I think I bought six or seven colors. Ugh. Here's another one. And it's good to know my ink didn't freeze. I was kind of afraid that my ink would freeze because it's been just so cold here. You know, I mean, I feel so bad for the people in New England because they've really had it bad. So I can't really complain like where I am. I mean, I can because it's not been the greatest, but at least it wasn't like it was last year, um, which I am eternally grateful for. Okay, one more. One more. Ah, jailbreak. Let me in. <laughs> Let me in. Oh, my goodness. Uh, ugh. There we go. I'm kind of making grunting noises as I tear into this package here. <laughs> but uh, let's see. I got, I got, um, oops. I got one, two, three, four, five, three, four, five, six, six inks. And one of them belongs to my husband, actually. So we got this uh, Waterman um, in tender purple. Now, sometimes what they'll do is they'll wrap the bottles because it will, you know, it'll just kind of give them like extra protection. But um, this is what this Waterman ink looks like. Kind of your your basic purple, purple ink, which my husband likes. And if I can get this put back in the box, there we go. Try to keep it as intact as possible there. And then the rest of these are some diamine inks, um, which is a, a brand of ink that um, that I really like. Here's what the box looks like for this. And the only difference is it'll tell like what color it is, like right there is as you can see. Okay, this one here is Amazing Amethyst, which is a purple color. Now, um. I won't show you the boxes in her. I mean, I'll, I showed you this one box, but I won't show you the rest of the boxes because um, it's, you know, you've seen one diamine box, you've seen them all. So that's um, Amazing Amethyst. This one is Havasu Turquoise. Had to uh, get my glasses so I could read it because sometimes this print is really, really tiny on it. But as you can see on the cap, if I can get it right there, uh, it's got the names of it uh, typed on that little strip right there. Um, and again, my camera's backwards, so you're going to see the print backwards. Uh, so in this in this shipment, I got quite a bit of purple and quite a bit of blue ink. <laughs> this one here is Deep Magenta. And again, the bottles look the same. Um, the bottles really do look the same in the ink. Uh, you can't really tell like what color the ink is like when you're looking inside of it, uh, especially if it's kind of a darker ink, like it's it looks really like concentrated in the in the bottles and all that but it's got the name of it right there on that little strip as, as you can see this next one is claret which is it kind of looks more like a um when i first saw the name i thought it would be kind of more like a red wine color um there it is right there on the on the top but it kind of looks more like a it almost kind of looks more like a deep pink kind of like a deep pink almost not really maroon but i don't know how to describe it um and it's really hard to get um, an idea of what these colors are like, um, you know, from the bottle, because you can't really see it, you, you know, you can't really see, like, what color it is in the bottle or anything, and I don't have, um, obviously I just got, uh, this ink, so I can't really give a, a writing sample unless I ink up one of my pens, uh, so if you guys are, like, interested in seeing what these colors actually look like, um, with pen and paper, let me know, um, I will do that, uh, let's see, and then this one is a sapphire blue color, Sapphire blue, that's what it's called. And again, the diamine box. And the sticker on it's coming off, but there's what it looks like. Again. It's 
got the name of it right there on the little strip. And this one is definitely a sapphire blue. I mean, it's it's a really nice, bright, very pretty bright blue. Um, I think I'm really going to like this one. Really think I'm going to like this one. So that is what I got from the Goulet Pen Company. Um, the pen and one, two, three, four, five, six inks. Which one of those inks belongs to my husband? He gets his Waterman ink. <laughs> so anyway, um, if you guys are interested in seeing what some of these colors actually look like with pen and paper, let me know. I will do that. Um, be more than happy to do that. Uh, if you guys want to see uh, some of the other inks that I have, I have a ton, let me tell you. <laughs> my husband thinks I'm crazy. Hello, my name is Sharon. I have an ink problem. Nice to meet you guys. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm funny that way. Anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul video. If you want to see more like this, let me know. Um, be glad to do them because I order from this company quite a bit and I just, I love them, love them, love them. Um, total, total five star shopping experience. I mean, as I said, I can't say enough about them. So highly, highly recommended. Um, but let me know if you want to see, um, this pen in action. Let me know if you want to see what these inks look like. Let me know if you want to see more fountain pen, fountain pen, bleh, more fountain pen videos. All right, guys, you have a great day and we will talk to you guys all later. Bye guys. Oh, got a little P.S. to add on to the end of this video. I found this in the bottom of the box, but um, here is a Goulet Pen Company sticker. Uh, I didn't see it at first, but it was kind of hiding in the bottom of the box. So I did want to show that to you because when I do these haul videos, I want to show you everything that you get in the package. You know, even, uh, you know, even like the, the little goodies, you know. And um, this you could like stick on top of your notebook or something like that. I, I may just I may just peel it off and stick it in my journal just because it makes me happy. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so you get some little goodies with that plus your um, items that you order. But anyway, um, that's going to be it for this video. As I said, um, this for real. Um, have a great day and we'll talk to you guys all later. Bye guys.